how is it going everybody Mr. Android here. Today I have got you a full tutorial on how to use KLWP to customize your Android device like a pro. Well a lot of you are asking me to make a video on this topic so I thought why not go ahead and make a dedicated video explaining each and everything about the custom live wallpaper. So if you really want to customize your home screen and make it look beautiful like this then make sure you stay tuned and watch the entire video. If you miss any step then it won't work properly for you. With that being said let's aim for 1500 likes on this one. So drop a like, leave a comment and let's get started. Alright guys, in order to apply any custom live wallpaper on your device, you need to install a third party launcher. Since most of the stock launchers does not support KLWP. So all you have to do is go to your play store and download this launcher called Noah launcher. I think it's one of the best customizable launcher that you can get from the play store. Once you are done installing the application, simply set it as your default launcher. Now again go back to the play store, this time download KLWP along with the pro version. Guys if you just download the free version then you will not be able to apply any presets. So I will highly recommend you to get the pro version. It is like a one time investment and I am sure you are going to love using this application. Next you can also download some free presets. Right now I am using Moshi for KLWP which is a free preset but you can download any preset of your choice. There are a lot of free as well as paid skins available in the play store. You will find a direct link for all the apps in the description. So if you want to download anything you can always go to this video description. After downloading the resources, first thing you need to do is you need to remove each and everything from your home screen and make it completely blank. Simply press and hold and tap on this remove button. Once you are done, now go to Noah settings, look and feel and hide the notification bar. By doing all this, you will have a blank home screen without the status bar as well. At this point, I will also suggest you to create a backup of this blank home screen. So whenever you want to apply any KLWP preset, you don't have to repeat all these steps. You can easily restore the backup that you have just created and have a plain home screen. Next, what you have to do is press and hold on the screen. Select wallpapers. Here you will find something called as live wallpaper. Simply click on it and then select custom. Now click on this gear icon and select load presets. Here you will have all the presets that you have downloaded on your phone. You need to select the preset that you want to apply. Then tap on the save icon. Finally select the wallpaper on your home screen. Once you are done, now you will have a beautiful looking home screen that you have just created using the custom live wallpaper. Well everything that you see here is fully functional. If you want, you can change the theme directly from here and the animation looks great as well. Just keep in mind some presets require 2 or 3 pages home screen. For that simply press on this plus icon and add additional pages. So that's pretty much it. This is how you can customize your home screen with the help of KLWP application. Some of my favorite presets are the Moshi for KLWP, Blossom KLWP and then I also like the Aura and the one for KLWP. These are my favorite plugins that you can find easily on the play store. With that said, if you still face any issue then let me know in the comment section, I will surely help you out. Also if you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.